platform. Some of the uh, more obvious reasons I think that this would be applicable um, in the why there is avoiding manual configuration. Uh, in, a, in a future slide, I'll refer to this as click ops. Um, the, the need to have to continue to click the same options in the Azure portal or within Microsoft Fabric to configure your workspaces, to configure your lake houses, warehouses, pipelines, et cetera. Infrastructure as code gives you a way to automate that and make that as repeatable and consistent uh, across your project implementations or within uh, your fabric configuration uh, within your organization. In situations of a disaster, so disaster recovery or DR, uh, you're going to have a quicker recovery time objective. You're going to have a quicker point of recovery in the event of a disaster if you have your infrastructure coded out as opposed to the previous point of having to go back in and do all your click ops and reconfigure everything that way. 